battery charge is connected. I did want to start it off and say thank you to everyone uh, for the simple fact that um, already you know we got we got more subscribers you know I think we're up to about 50 56 around about that who am I kidding uh, I check it every single day <laughs> um, but no I'm, I'm excited it means that look things are happening um, videos that I'm making are, are being watched and the appreciation from me to you guys is huge um, that's why I'm doing it. Uh, I'm doing it because I want to share. That's why I did it. That's why I started the channel. Um, and I just really want to say thank you to everybody who's watching and who will be watching and future watchers and, and everything. The support has been great. The reason why I decided to do um, sort of a midweek vlog, this was kind of a little bit important for the simple fact that I am driving to a bit of an appointment today. The appointment is a bit of a stepping stone for me uh, in life. I won't get too involved in why or where I'm going with it. Uh, for the simple fact that I don't know if I'm gonna go that way yet, just unless you know me personally about what I do. Um, I'm obviously in um, you know, retail and, and car parts and stuff like that, that's my job. So this meeting is a bit of a touching base on that sort of stuff and look, it could be a stepping stone to something bigger uh, for me. Um, and obviously for, you know, hopefully family members to get involved as well. Um, that's my ultimate goal in life is to um, do well for myself so I can do well for others. Um, and that includes people that watch this. Um, and in that form, you know, maybe information, uh, maybe a bit of insight as to where and how I've sort of gone about my life and, and that may help others too. That's what I want to give back to everybody um, in a physical way and obviously, you know, in, in a, in a sort of speaking form way to people watching. So yeah, that's where I'm headed now. I'm, I'm headed into the city. Another one was just to fill you guys in as to um, what will be happening in the next couple of days as well. Uh, a few more exciting things for you guys to watch and for me to sort of head it up. Um, I did get invited to a bit of a car meet on the weekend. This will be the Sunday. They want me to sort of um, park at the front and do the whole, um, you know, with all the special car thing, which I think every car is special in its own way. And that's, again, that's not me either. Like, I'm always a little bit hesitant when people offer me um, something out of the ordinary or, or, you know, like a more of a prominent role in what they're doing. Because, look, I, I'm happy just to roll up and park at the back. I just, not that I don't like to share uh, the car with people or anything like that. I'd rather just go there and see what everyone else is doing and, and, and the show in general and just sort of sit back and, and relax. Um, but I'll do that, I'll drop the car off and, and do right by the people who invited me. I'll, I'll put the details down in the description below, so if you guys do watch this or you are heading out anyways, come down and have a look. Uh, the car will be on show, the car is um, finished, all the hard work is done. I'm sure you've seen the last videos where I had to literally pull the car entirely apart. And that was a massive undertaking. Um, I knew what was going to happen, I knew those parts had to come off. Um, so it was just pretty much making the time and actually doing it. I've had a few comments now as well, obviously with, with the um, subscriber base building a little bit. Um, obviously some people that know me and others I'm not too familiar with, um, but in time I might get to know you, that, that'll be a good thing. I got some questions about, you know, how, how do you learn how to pull these cars apart? I'm not a frying technician by any means, someone, someone said that and that was a massive compliment. <laughs> um, no, I'm not. Um, I've just grown up with cars. Um, my dad was a mechanic, um, and as a kid, what I used to do is pull my toys apart, to be honest. My favorite thing in the world was a little uh, red-handled Phillips head screwdriver that I sort of got in my dad's toolbox, and um, basically everything I owned from there on out, I uh, pulled apart. That's what I did. I always pulled things apart. And you know what? Yeah, sure, I broke some stuff um, when I was a kid pulling, you know, remote control cars apart. But that's how you learn. You pull things apart. You learn what you can and can't be rough with. You learn what, what needs to come off first. It's, it's all that. And that's where I started. 
um, and I guess look as I got older like anyone if you're into cars that's the next step isn't it you buy cars and you start pulling them apart so you know I started pulling cars apart from a young age and and that's sort of where it sort of came from um, and look the Ferrari is just a car it, it's just a car so I wasn't afraid to attack this like any other car with a screwdriver and, and all the other tools I needed to pull it apart and just go for it. Um, as long as you're careful and, and you, you take your time, it's all gonna go back on the way it came off. Um, you just don't force things and, and move things too, too, too roughly, should I say. But the car's done. I, I do apologize, this is a bit of a talking vlog, um, a bit of an expression as to what I'm doing and what's happening. Um, and look, like I said, the channel is growing a little bit now too. There is a few more subscribers. Questions are coming, that's that's good. Um, I'm gonna try and keep up with them. There's not a lot right now, but eventually it will probably get to the point where I will struggle. But right now I am getting questions, which means questions lead to answers, which can lead to videos. Uh, and that's where I was sort of going with this um, bit of a vlog as to explaining what I will be doing. Uh, and even on social media, I'm getting through a few questions from people as well, um, you know, about the car, um, about what I do, how I afford these things, that sort of stuff. And I'm happy to share it if you're asking the questions. Um, so look, I think videos will come out of that as well. Like, you know, I'm getting questions like, you know, what does it cost to run this car? Um, what does, what's insurance like? You know, stuff like that. And I think I'll do a bit of a video for the people asking those questions. I'll, um, you know, put one up on what it's like to own the car, the costs involved in the car. So that would be another one coming. Like I said, this was a bit of an in-between vlog, uh, vlog for me. Just so I could update you and obviously tell you what I'm doing today. It's why I sort of wanted to get it uh, recorded because, you know, I look back on these videos and go, okay, that's where I was at then. So that's why I wanted to do it now because this may eventuate into something, this may not, I don't know yet. It's all just one of those things. If you don't, if you don't try and step forward or, or try and do things, um, to better yourself, you just won't. Um, it's a simple fact. You can't, you're not going to sit around and wait for things to happen. And you should learn that very, very soon uh, uh, in life that nothing comes easy. I mean, luck plays a part for sure. So, you know, some people are more lucky than others. Um, some people have to work that little bit harder to create those, um, you know, to create those things where you, you, you'll have the opportunity to step up or or to do something in life that changes it for, for a big part. And I've always been the one out, one to go out and grab those opportunities to, to make it happen because sitting around, you're just wasting time and, and literally time is very precious. We only have so much of it. Um, and that's what I want to sort of touch base on that look. If you want something, go out, go out and grab it. Um, go out and achieve, do what you need to do to get there because anybody can do anything. Um, and <laughs> this is not a pep talk either. Um, Look, I, I would like to put some of those videos up, um, you know, maybe sharing my story with people too might inspire you to do other things or or to do, you know, to, to do something that you've wanted to do that you thought is unachievable. Um, because it's not, it definitely isn't. If I'm living and breathing proof of that, it's a simple fact that we all started somewhere and started with nothing um, in most cases. And that comes uh, right up my alley. I started with nothing, you know, and not saying I've got everything in the world, but I'm happy. Um, not saying I would never achieve to do more because I always do. I'm, I'm a hungry type of person. Um, you know, I, I like to move forward. You know, I'm a bit one of those people that can't sit still, can't stand still. I've got to be moving all the time and that's within life as well. I always want to be achieving and look, you know, for, for people that are ambitious, you never feel like you're doing as much as you can be or, um, you know, you're never happy where you're at. And that, that's not a bad thing. Look, you know, you've always got to remember where you came from. That's, that's one thing. Never forget where you came from because that's the biggest thing because you, you start with nothing. So don't ever think you're above anyone else because you're definitely not. Everyone's, everyone's equal and there's no word of a lie on that one. Um, it doesn't matter what you have or, or anything like that around you. Things are just a measure of success for some people. For me, they're just goals um, of what I set myself because then um, I push myself to work that little bit harder to, to achieve my next goal and that's not the same for everybody. Uh, life is different for everyone. But I thought it was important to, to voice some stuff and that's why I wanted to share with you guys this one. Um, without getting too much involved and look, I, I tend to wrap myself up in um, talking too much. 
but um, just want to touch base on some stuff. It was a bit of a ramble and a jump from here to there, but all I'm trying to say is um, the channel is going to continue. It, it's going to evolve. Um, it's definitely going to take different directions. Those directions, I don't know yet. I am a car person, so that's a big part of my life, so that's a big part of the channel. So I'll be sharing a lot of that with you guys. The travel, there's travel to come. I do go overseas um, with the family, so that's a big thing. That's, that's coming. Vlogging will be a big part of it because again, it's it's I like to share and if you like guys like to watch I'm gonna to continue to share and continue to put these videos up. So I'll call, keep that Well, it's not really short and sweet because even by the time I edit it, I guarantee this is ten minutes of me just raving and talking but it was just a bit of a duty of care on my part to keep you guys in the loop as to, to things to come and to keep you guys informed so I'm gonna take this mount off because my hands are freezing uh, it is warm outside so I have got the air conditioner on and I'm holding that mount in front of a vent so my hands or hand is frozen I can't feel it um, so I am going to cut it there hopefully you enjoyed me ranting and raving but I thought I would share regardless because what's the point of having vlogs if you're not sort of uh, sharing the in-between as well as the good as well as the bad and everything it's about being real and I'd rather show you the realest part of me and that's me sharing uh, a bit of my life with you guys so I hope you enjoyed that I am getting a green light so I am going to end it there um, because I need one hand on the wheel and one hand on the mount at this point look out for Sunday I will be doing uh, a bit of a vlog and a run through on that car event as well showing you what's there um, maybe give me a bit more of a look of the finished product of the Ferrari with the carbon fiber things I know I have been a little bit short on showing you guys that I just haven't had a lot of time so I will walk you around and what I've done and, and what's changed on the car okay meeting is over um, yeah I'm feeling good I'm feeling positive um, this could be what I've strived for all my life just a big part of um, where I want to be I mean I'm very ambitious um, so something like this is is big it's it's very very big so like I said don't know if it's gonna happen not not entirely sure yet this is still sort of let's just call it a feeling out process a good feel now it's just about sort of working out the numbers if it can happen uh, where it can happen and, and when it's gonna happen so I just wanted to sort of uh, fill you in on what happened <laughs> so positive, definitely positive. Um, so that was good, and I just wanted to share it with you guys. Other than that, I am heading home, and I am going to call it a day. And even then, I said goodbye to you in the last one. I'll edit that out, and this would be the thanks for watching, guys. So have a great day, everyone. Um, there will be more to come, as I said, and thanks for the support and everything. And again, thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Thank you. Thank you.